Hello, you are welcome. Here, how to solve this nice exponential equation. We have 36 raised to the power x minus 9 raised to the power x equals to 18 raised to the power x. And from here, we are finding the value of x, which is a positive number. So now, let's write this as 6 squared to the power of x, then minus here, 3 squared to the power of x, then equals to here, we can write it as 6 times 3 to the power of x. Then from here, we apply the law of indices, it means we can interchange this power, and we can write it as 6 raised to the power x, then square, then minus here, we can write as 3 raised to the power x, square, which is equals to this power of x, we have fragged these two numbers, we have 6, raised to the power x times 3 raised to the power x. Then in the next step we have 6 raised to the power x common, 3 raised to the power x common. So let a letter represent let m now be equal to 6 raised to the power x and n be equal to 3 raised to the power x. Then we can write this equation in terms of m and n and this will be m square minus n square then equals to m times n that's m a on this side from here let's divide both sides by n square so divide this side by n square here one n we cancel out n we cancel out one n here we mean m over n and we can separate this side as m square over n square then minus n square over n square which is equal to n over n on this side then from here we have power of 2 common we can write it as m over n all square then minus this we cancel out and we remain 1 so that minus 1 equals to m over n then from here as well we have m over n common so we can say let a letter t now be equals to m over n such that we write this again as t square minus 1 equals to t then we can take t to this side to form an equation and this will be t square minus t minus 1 be equals to 0 then from here we we solve this by using a quadratic formula that is t now will be equals to minus d and this minus 1 minus minus 1 plus or minus square root of d square minus 1 square minus 4 ac a is 1 then c is minus 1 then over 2a that's 2 times 1 then from here when we solve this we have t now to be equal to this is plus one that's one plus or minus minus one square that's t one the minus times minus plus that's four over two then from here we have t to be equal to one plus or minus root five over two so here we are going to have two values of t the first one we have t to be equal to 1 plus root 5 over 2 and the second one we have t to be equal to 1 minus root 5 over 2 then recall that we represented t as m over n and also we denoted m as 6 raised to the power x and the n as 3 raised to the power x which of course we can write as well, since the power of x is common this will be 6 over 3 to the power of x from here and which will give us 6 divided by 3 that's 2 raised to the power x from here it means t can be written as 2 raised to the power x and we stated from the beginning that we are interested in finding 
a positive number of x here. If x is positive, it implies that t will also be positive. So now, when we look at these two cases, this side is, of course, will be a positive number, and this side will be a negative number. And if we say t is positive, it implies that it, this side cannot be negative. So here, we are not going to continue further. Then, we work with this side, and uh, we equate t, which is 2 raised to the power x, now will be equal to 1 plus root 5 over 2. Now, from here, we solve by taking the log on both sides. We have log 2 to the power x equals to log 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then from here, from the power of log in, x can come to the back. We have x log 2 now will then be equals to log 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then from here, divide by log 2 and then divide this side by log 2. Of course, log 2 we can't switch other. Then we are left with x, which is then equals to log 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then from change of base, instead of dividing by log 2, we can say the 2. So here we have the value of x in this given problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos. Turn the notification bell on. Share this video. Give it a thumbs up. You can put your comment in the comment section. Thank you. See you in the next class. And bye.